Hello everyone, Shamnali Gray, Goddess Creation. I am here after a four day event around Ostara and women's business, let's say. A lovely retreat away with sisters, with women, where we are celebrating our bodies. And afterwards we were celebrating Ostara, the spring equinox, the moment when the dark becomes less than the light in hours in the day. The birthing of the new year, the birthing of the new you, you know, the, the fruit coming out of the ground. I hosted that last bit together with a few other sisters of myself, made, um, creating a lovely Ostara ritual, a birthing ritual. It was wonderful. And throughout all these four days, it was easy. Just, I just breezed through everything. I had fun, the transformational work for me was before those days started, the going deep, the, the entering into what are my questions, what are, is needed. Hi Miriam, thank you for watching. Going deep into these rituals, that was where my biggest work was. So I thought, oh, those four days of ritual were easy. And then yesterday I came home, or at least when I, it was Monday I believe, and I came home and I was just went, ah, oh, and I just released. And then the tiredness came after four days of holding space, four days of going through rituals of women's bodies, loving yourself, of allowing um, the, the, the spring, the fullness to rise up in you, holding space. And then I could release. And then my period started. And I thought, that's early. And I already have a short cycle of 25 days, but now my cycle was 23 days. And yet I was not confused by that because that to me also happens after deep ritual work. Your body adjusts and transforms and your cells change. And so today I had a coach call that I was going to be hosting for someone. And she cancelled because she had another appointment. Her work was delayed. And that was all fine because in this last year I learned that God has three answers. Yes, not now, or something better. And so when I thought, ah, she's cancelled and she couldn't make it on a, a later time in the day, I could relax because I thought, ah, something better's coming. And then the release came. <sighs> and I went into... But well, my second day of the period came and I could allow the, the, all the changes in the body, the, all the release of whatever that was triggered in these four days rituals to come. I knew that the pain that I was feeling inside, which was more intense than other months, was okay because I was releasing baggage that was triggered and peeled away in those four days of ritual. And so I could lie down and roll up in my bed and just rock and sleep and let it happen. That is what I am sharing with you. The vulnerability of these type of transformations, the vulnerability of myself, showing myself in a different way. And yet, I am sharing with you that I can also hold space for you. For when you go through life transformations, when you make decisions that are huge, when you look into the mirror and see what it is you want to change and are willing to change, then your cells, your whole body changes and adapts. And that can make some waves and that will make you tired or make you feel sick or make you even feel scared. But know this, you are not alone on this journey. Just by sharing this, you know that we are all in it together and that we are all changing for the good. If you would like any help, just reach out to me, Shamnali Gray, or at info at goddesscreations.nl. I wish you a lovely transformation and birthing into the new year. Until next time, Shamnali Gray, Goddess Creations. Bye-bye.